uh, you may not know this, but all of us have about 75 uh, million stem cells that are in our bodies at any given time. And we're actually made of the stem cells because when, when we were in our mom's wombs, the only reason our bodies were able to even form a human figure, like, you know, the little Play-Doh that <laughs> forms humans in the womb is is because of stem cells and we retain some of those after we're born and we lock them up in our bone marrow and in our skin and elsewhere and our bodies regenerate continuously that's one of our health defense systems because you know you know as we age we need to repair ourselves from the inside out dr william lee has discussed various compounds antioxidants and nutrients found in fruits that can potentially support or boost stem cell function in this video, Dr. Lee will discuss various compounds, antioxidants, and nutrients found in fruits that support or boost stem cell function. Here is Dr. Lee to tell us more about where his research into stem cells and fruits is headed. Like we know um, our hair regrows for most people. We know that um, even our, gut, our our mucous membranes, our, 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 uh, the sort of skin in our mouth, we grow. Anybody who's ever, you know, um, had a, really hot uh something a hot piece of food and you burn your mouth and you're like man like it it totally s screws you up <laughs> next day you're back to normal because your your skin in your mouth your mucous membrane regenerated okay it's like eating a dorito and you scrape the top of your mouth next day you'll be fine because of regeneration um but is what's amazing is that our organs regenerate from the inside out if i took your liver and we cut off two thirds of your liver and left one third left, it would regenerate the rest of the two thirds. So just like a starfish would regenerate an arm. Um, of, of your lung, if I cut off the tip of your lung, um, it would grow right back. And what we're starting to realize is that the, the playbook of human biology is being, is being rewritten because when you and I were kids, I'm sure our grade school teachers taught us the same thing. Starfish and salamanders regenerate, but people don't wrong people regenerate and so now we can actually try to coax this regeneration to go faster it's one of our defense systems but um and, and while biotech people are trying to figure out ways to make us regenerate foods can also cause us to prompt regeneration as well which is really cool mother nature has laced um, things that can be regenerative like ursolic acid and fruit peel can coax our stem cells to come out of our um, bone marrow to, to stimulate regeneration as well i mean imagine a future in which we understood how to match the, uh, the substance in a food that naturally occurs with something that we need like brain regeneration for dementia, for example, that would really be a game changer. And so that's where the future of understanding our bodies hardwired self-defenses for regeneration goes. Versolic acid is found in fruits such as apples, cranberries, and blueberries. In addition to what Dr. Lee just said about ursolic acid, it offers a range of other health benefits, particularly due to its anti-inflammatory properties. This compound has been shown to also potentially promote muscle growth and regeneration, making it of interest for those looking to enhance physical performance and recovery. By reducing inflammation, ursolic acid may create a more favorable environment for muscle repair and growth. Hey there, I wanted to share with you one of my favorite fruits. This is a peach, one of my favorite summer fruits. Juicy, you can smell the fragrance. The peach actually comes from Asia. Uh, actually, it was transplanted and transported along the Silk Road. And it's got chlorogenic acid. This is actually a bioactive that uh, actually does a lot of things. It um, cuts off the blood supply to tumors, it actually helps to protect stem cells, your health defenses. Also good for gut health, and it's also got a good amount of dietary fiber. Uh, but the interesting thing about chlorogenic acid is it actually helps your metabolism by fighting body fat. So you can activate your good fat and fight your bad fat using chlorogenic acid. Plus, it's just a juicy, great fruit to select during the summer. What you want to do is you want to smell it, and it should actually smell really good. And by the way, Yellow peaches actually tend to be a little bit sweeter and juicier than white peaches, but white peaches are also delicate and great. Dr. Will Lee out. Along with peaches, chlorogenic acid is also present in fruits such as apples, plums, and pears. It is also known for its potent antioxidant properties. 
This compound may help reduce inflammation and support overall cellular health, contributing to the body's ability to maintain homeostasis. The overall health benefits of chlorogenic acid could indirectly support stem cell function. Blue comes from blueberries. Their beautiful blue color comes from a natural dye called anthocyanin. That's an antioxidant that protects your DNA, helps build your immune system, and also improves your metabolism as well. In addition to blueberries, anthocyanins are also found in fruits such as acai berries, blackberries, strawberries, cherries, and purple grapes. They are powerful antioxidants known for their protective properties. They help shield stem cells from oxidative stress, which can damage cells and hinder their function. Additionally, anthocyanins possess anti-inflammatory qualities that can reduce inflammation, a condition that may impair stem cell activity. By mitigating both oxidative stress and inflammation, anthocyanins support not only the health of stem cells but also their ability to contribute effectively to tissue repair and regeneration. Zeaxanthin and lutein are two compounds, two natural chemicals, that are found in goji berries. Goji berries are sort of this um, Chinese medicine, herbal medicine type of thing. They're little tiny dried um, uh, ovoid looking things. They're sometimes found in Chinese teas, for example. Um, but they're actually quite popular um, now as sort of a health um, uh, supplement or a health food to eat. You can find goji berries snacking on them in uh, different types of supermarkets that are, have a health oriented section. Lutein and zeaxanthin actually are um, present in goji berries and they mobilize your stem cells. They protect your stem cells and they mobilize them as well. So this is an example of two substances that go hand in hand in both. Zeaxanthin are also found in citrus fruits and berries. It is a powerful antioxidant known for its protective properties. This carotenoid plays a crucial role in shielding cells from oxidative damage, which can lead to various health issues, including inflammation and cellular aging. By neutralizing harmful free radicals, zeaxanthin helps maintain cellular integrity and supports overall health. Lutein is a carotenoid antioxidant that can also be found in citrus fruits such as oranges, grapefruits, lemons, and limes, as well as in berries like blueberries, strawberries, raspberries, and blackberries. This powerful antioxidant plays a significant role in protecting cells from oxidative damage, which can contribute to chronic diseases and age-related conditions. By neutralizing free radicals, lutein helps maintain cellular health and supports overall well-being. Well, strawberries have something called elagic acid. Mm -hmm. In fact, elagic acid is what's make a nice strawberry tart. So strawberries are sweet, they're a little tart, um, uh, and the tartness comes from elagic acid. Well, elagic acid is made by strawberries. It cuts off the blood supply to tumors. It's such a good for your metabolism, burns down harmful body fat, um, is antioxidant, protects your DNA, lowers inflammation, as well as vitamin C in the same strawberry, um, and activates your stem cells. So what's not, like, what's not to like about strawberries? You'd want as much elagic acid as possible. In addition to strawberries, elagic acid is found in raspberries, blackberries, and pomegranates. It is a notable antioxidant recognized for its protective effects on stem cells. By shielding these vital cells from oxidative damage, elagic acid plays a crucial role in maintaining their health and functionality. Additionally, this compound may help reduce inflammation in the body, further supporting cellular integrity and overall well-being. Related to tomatoes are, is watermelon juice. Now you're like, wait a minute, Dr. Lee, watermelons, tomatoes, nothing alike. You are right, except both Tomatoes and watermelons have lycopene. That's right, watermelon, which has got red flesh. Remember I told you the lycopene helps to provide color. Watermelon has lycopene. It's got a lot of fluid in it, which is good, but it's also got lycopene in it. Um, a lot of people don't know this, but watermelons were not originally, they came from Africa, but they were not originally red. They, I think they were yellow and they weren't sweet. They were just used for water, for hydration and, you know, the hot environment. But over time, they got bred to be red and sweet, and that redness actually uh, brought with it uh, lycopene. In addition to watermelon, lycopene, a potent antioxidant also found in pink grapefruit and guava, 
It plays a significant role in protecting stem cells from oxidative damage. This compound helps neutralize harmful free radicals, thereby safeguarding cellular health and function. In addition to its antioxidant properties, lycopene may also aid in reducing inflammation within the body, which is crucial for maintaining optimal cellular activity. There are foods that just can actually automatically boost our immune system by themselves. Mm -hmm. One of them is mango. You know, I love mangoes. They're juicy, sweet, filled with fiber. They got lots of vitamins and they also have bioactives. And, and I call them mango, by the way, mangoes and stone fruit grand slammers of foods. These are foods, a whole table of foods I have in my, um, in my uh, book that all activate all five um, uh, defense systems at the same time, including the immune system. So you can slam it out of the park by eating these foods. Mango is one of my favorites. Tasty, juicy, sweet. You get vitamins, good minerals, and it actually contains these natural bioactives that actually can help boost your immune system. In addition to mangoes, beta carotene is found in fruits such as papaya, cantaloupe, and apricots. It is a vital precursor to vitamin A, which plays a key role in supporting immune function and promoting cell growth. This powerful antioxidant also helps protect stem cells from oxidative damage, ensuring their health and functionality. By neutralizing harmful free radicals, beta-carotene contributes to cellular integrity and resilience. One more apple fact. Apples are one of the highest sources of a natural bioactive called procyanidins. Procyanidins light up your brown fat to burn down harmful fat. Again, good for your metabolism three ways and also helps protect your stem cells to help regenerate your body from the inside out. What's not to like about this? Go for an apple a day. Procyanidins are classified as flavonoids, abundant in foods like apples, grapes, berries. Procyanidins are known for their strong antioxidant properties, which help protect cells from oxidative stress and free radical damage. Other flavonoids are abundant in citrus fruits, berries, and apples. They are renowned for their antioxidant properties that play a crucial role in protecting stem cells from oxidative stress. By neutralizing harmful free radicals, these compounds help maintain cellular integrity and health. Additionally, flavonoids exhibit anti-inflammatory effects, which may aid in reducing inflammation and enhancing stem cell function. But what about prevention? What are foods that can prevent cancer? Well, it turns out that two apples a day actually can lower the rate of, uh, of lung cancer wow. and colon cancer. Why? Because there are natural substances in apples like quercetin. That's one of the natural chemicals that actually are naturally anti-angiogenic. In addition to apples, quercetin, a powerful antioxidant, is also found in citrus fruits and various berries. It plays a crucial role in protecting stem cells from oxidative stress. By neutralizing free radicals, quercetin helps safeguard cellular health and integrity. Additionally, this compound is known for its anti-inflammatory properties, which may aid in reducing inflammation and promoting optimal stem cell function. Here are some other compounds contained in various fruit that are beneficial to your stem cells. Catechins, including Epigolocatechin gala DGCG, are powerful antioxidants found in apples and various berries, particularly blueberries. These compounds play a vital role in protecting stem cells from oxidative damage by neutralizing harmful free radicals, thereby preserving cellular health. In addition to their antioxidant effects, catechins have been shown to possess anti-inflammatory properties which may help reduce inflammation and promote optimal stem cell function. Vitamin C, found in abundance in citrus fruits, kiwi, strawberries, and papaya, is essential for collagen synthesis which supports tissue repair and regeneration. This vital nutrient plays a significant role in maintaining healthy skin, cartilage, and connective tissues, facilitating the body's healing processes. Additionally, vitamin C is a potent antioxidant that helps protect stem cells from oxidative damage by neutralizing harmful free radicals. Polyphenols, which are found in pomegranates, berries, and grapes, are powerful antioxidants that play a vital role in protecting stem cells from oxidative stress. 
By neutralizing harmful free radicals, these compounds help safeguard cellular health and integrity. In addition to their antioxidant properties, polyphenols are known for their anti-inflammatory effects, which may contribute to reducing inflammation and promoting optimal stem cell function. Pronthocyanins, found in cranberries, blueberries, and grape seeds, are powerful antioxidants that play a crucial role in protecting stem cells from oxidative damage. By neutralizing harmful free radicals, these compounds help maintain cellular health and integrity. In addition to their antioxidant capabilities, pronthocyanins also possess anti-inflammatory properties which may aid in reducing inflammation and promoting optimal stem cell function. Incorporating foods rich in pronthocyanins into your diet can therefore support overall health by enhancing the resilience of stem cells and fostering a balanced inflammatory response in the body. Feistin, a flavonoid found in strawberries and apples, is renowned for its antioxidant properties which play a vital role in protecting stem cells from oxidative damage. By neutralizing harmful free radicals, Feistin helps maintain cellular health and integrity. Additionally, this compound exhibits neuroprotective effects, potentially supporting brain health and enhancing cognitive function. Including feistin-rich foods in your diet can not only bolster the health of stem cells but also contribute to improved mental clarity and overall cognitive well-being. Resveratrol, a beneficial compound found in red and purple grapes, blueberries, and cranberries, is celebrated for its potent antioxidant properties that help protect stem cells from oxidative damage. By neutralizing harmful free radicals, resveratrol contributes to maintaining cellular health and integrity. Moreover, this remarkable compound acts as a sirtuin activator, which may promote longevity and support overall cellular health. Incorporating resveratrol-rich foods into your diet can enhance both the resilience of stem cells and contribute to a healthier, more vibrant life. Next, watch the Dr. William Lee Club playlist for more information on the stem cell foods. Thanks for watching Longevity Deprocessed. Hit like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on evidence-based longevity tips. Share your thoughts in the comments, your journey matters. Remember, small daily habits create big changes. Until next time, keep deprocessing for a healthier, longer future. Let's make this journey together.